in Massachusetts, here in Minute Man. We are about 10 miles west of Boston at Minute Maid. Minute Maid? What am I talking about? It's lemonade. On the morning of 1775, on this very trail, 700 British troops marched from Boston to Concord to confiscate weapons hidden by the local militia, also known as the Minutemen. William Dawes and Paul Revere were sent out to warn the colonial militia in nearby towns. This is the spot where he was caught. This was the spot where he was apprehended at 1.30 in the morning. His horse was taken and then he was released. We are right now going across the famous North Bridge. This is the very spot where the colonists were assembled. As they looked across that great North Bridge, they saw the British Army staring them down. They shot for the first time on the King's Army. This was the first time that someone from the British colony died in warfare. This was the shot heard around the world. This was the beginning of the American Revolution. They seemed totally outnumbered. You had 700 British soldiers, the world's most powerful army, but word started spreading amongst the colonists. 1,500 colonists gathered together to fight them as they're heading back 14 and a half miles back to Boston. This is the spot called Bloody Angle. This is the spot where most of the British soldiers died that day. The country was an amazing strong one, full of hills, woods, stone walls, which the rebels did not fail to take advantage of, for they were all lined with people who kept an incessant fire upon us, but not with the same advantage, for they were so concealed there was hardly any seeing them. In this way we marched between nine and ten miles, their numbers increasing from all parts, while ours was reducing from deaths, wounds, and fatigue. Ensign John Barker, British soldier. About 700 British soldiers set out from Boston. Almost 300 of them die in this battle as they make their way back. Along the trail you see these makeshift grave sites. So you're in a foreign land, you're tired, you still got 12 miles at this point to get back to Boston. The trail on both sides is lined with loyal Minutemen and many of them are hiding behind barriers like this historic rock behind me just waiting to pick you off. 